The voice. I can't hear the voice anymore. <laughs> Is somebody there? Hey, who are you? Soon be time, Edward Pierce. You are dead. None of this is real. I saw you dead, as I see you now. Am I crazy too? You survived. Don't you understand? You couldn't die. You will stay alive until you fulfilled your destiny. No. Look at me. Look at me, Pierce. Dare tell me that you still don't believe it. This is madness. I'm here to guide you. You mean, like the voice? Don't you feel him? But it can't be. He's gone. You're mistaken. He's still inside of us. It's not just your life that is at stake. Many men and women have sacrificed themselves for this moment. Colden! You will not deprive them of their hope of a better life. I saw what Leviathan did to Fuller. We will all die like him. His life was written well before it started. It was not predetermined that he lived to see the call. But you? Yes. It is your destiny. Investigation. I understand now. Like you, I was called here by a higher power. Yes. All your choices had the sole purpose of preparing you for the final decision. I must make a choice. Not just make a choice. The right choice. Not yet, but soon. We have one more thing to accomplish. What is it? I must take you to Sarah Hawkins, our Oracle. Sarah, tell me where you took her. 
We'll find her at Alabaster Point. I'm going to get her. Don't try to stop me. Of course. Shut up. Get out of my way. Stop fighting the dead. No one can fight their fate. Neither them, nor you. Resist, Edward. They're already dead. There's nothing you can do. Just give in. What happened to me? Sarah. She will know what to do. 